Hi, I'm Shira, founder of Gritty and Pink. We are a new platform to empower women in music. We are building the In Pink Marketplace, connecting music industry pros to a diverse community of female creators. The really cool thing about the In Pink Marketplace is just seeing all of these incredible artists in one spot. You can actually filter by diversity tags. We pride ourselves on having a diverse talent pool. So let's say you were looking for a queer creator to create a Pride Month campaign. You can select queer and find exactly what you're looking for, then browse their portfolios, look at their work, read their bios, check out their links, and request a book right on the platform. We charge our service fee on the buyer side, so women get to keep 100% of what they earn. Sometimes I forget just how male-dominated it is until Brady and Pink came into my life and I was like, there's a different way to do this. Brady and Pink started as a concert series. We created this magical community and then of course COVID hit. So we ended up pivoting to Instagram live stream fundraisers. And before we knew it, we were raising thousands of dollars for charities and getting over 1,500 live viewers per show. Once we got our community going with musicians, we thought, why stop there? Let's open up our community to women working in all aspects of the industry. And we're directly putting dollars back into the hands of female creators. We're able to connect, we're able to celebrate each other, we're able to network and keep our projects and our art. A lot of people's excuse is that, oh sure, we'd love to hire a, a female basis, but where do I find one? Here. Here you go. It's a really great collaboration of fierce female creatives. I would say that in and of itself is unstoppable. I think it's important what Shira is doing with Gritty and Pink because what I like to do is talk to these girls and I hear the stories of their pain. And this is something that is going to relieve a huge pain point for them. Hopefully we can look back in a year and say, wow, you know, we put a million dollars into the hands of women in this industry.